Hello, I'm Michael J. Lavery from Perfect Penmanship. I'm currently wearing the Focus Band. This is a technology that you can find on the internet. This technology actually shows if you're in either the left brain, which is the analytical side of the brain, or you're in the right brain, that is in the calm motion reading. That word motion comes from the Japanese, meaning the calm mind. Let's proceed to go over to my writing table and we'll take one of the templates from the Perfect Penmanship book and then we'll see if I can actually get into the right side of my brain. As I mentioned before, I'm using the focus band at the present and I have the baseline reading at 24. So even in the act of speaking to you, I'm still achieving what they would call the motion reading. So it'll go back from the red back over to the green. So now I'm in the red and I'm hopefully going back to the green. Notice that when I'm actually acting as I'm writing. I'm writing with two hands at the same time. I'm imagining I'm writing. Can you see this really dark green band here? That's called the quiet eye. Now in the act of doing ambidexterity, just acting as though I'm doing cursive handwriting with either hand, I'm lighting up the right side of my brain. You can see the motion reading is rising. Now, this is one of the perfect penmanship templates here. So let's take a look at this one here. The Road Not Taken by Robert Frost. Now I'm going to get into this state where I'm relaxed and I'm going to trace directly over the writing. Now the whole time that I was writing The Road Not Taken, I was listening to the sound that was telling me that I was maintaining activity in my right hemisphere. So let's now push this button here and we have settings. I'm going to move the motion reading up to 48, no, 48 here. Let's see if I can get 48. There we go, 47, 48, four, let's call it 49. Now the goal is to keep pushing the envelope into the right hemisphere and trace directly over the writing. That's why I designed these penmanship templates for my students so that they can get into the state of being cool, calm, and contemplative. Notice that even in the act of speaking to you, I'm still maintaining activity in the right side of my brain. Now, when a person's actually writing over this entire poem, the goal is to stay directly on top of each letter. Do not cut the corner. Oftentimes in life, we cut the corners when a person's doing penmanship training. It's firing parts of the brain that normally are not engaged in the act of manually typing away at one's iPad or their laptop or their computer terminal. Even in the act of speaking to you in a nice, calm manner. I'm achieving the motion reading. So let's push the envelope a little bit higher, ladies and gentlemen. Let's bring up this motion reading up into 60 now. Let me see if I can still achieve the right side of the brain. Sorry, I could.
could not travel. I have clients that have had problems sleeping for years and they start these penmanship templates in the evening and they have deep sound sleep. They get these tingling sensations on their scalp. I want you to do some research on ASMR, autotomous sensory meridian response. Many of my clients tell me that they have a tingling sensation on their scalp. Notice that in the act of speaking to you at the present, I am maintaining left hemisphere dominance now as soon as I think about writing with my left hand. This is called the mirror writing. Watch the screen automatically go back into the motion reading on the right side of my brain. I just wrote, my mirror writing opens up my right hemisphere. Notice as soon as I started to speak, I went back to my left hemisphere where our speech centers are located. Now, as soon as I hold the pen in my right hand and bring it to the paper and start writing in a normal direction from left to right, we should start to achieve motion reading again. Now, is that an accident, ladies and gentlemen? I don't believe so. I think, therefore I am, I think, every time I put pen to paper, I activate my basal ganglia bilaterally. Let's continue. As soon as I start to speak again, it goes into the red reading. This is the avatar. As soon as I start humming, come on over to my, come on over to my side of the river. But as soon as I put the pen to paper, Pulled the pen from the paper, I went directly back into my left hemisphere. Now, let's see if we can act as though we're writing with two hands at the same time. I'm doing an experiment now to see if we can get over into the motion reading, but I've lowered it down with the baseline to 27. So it's going from the red back to the green. Now, they say that when you're playing a musical instrument, this is how you get into the calm state of your brain, especially if you're playing a, a country song or an old Western, like there's a young cowboy that lives on the range, his horse and his cattle, his only companion. It's amazing. I'm not getting into the motion reading. Now I'm getting in there. 
What is it about playing music that makes people believe that this is the ultimate state of getting cool, calm, and collected? Have you ever thought about how many times musicians have problems with drugs and alcohol? Maybe they're not truly getting into the motion reading and the calm state of their brain. Maybe some of the content within their music and the excessive beats per minute happens to be causing much anxiety. So when we are listening to classical music and the beats are 60 to 80 beats per minute, oftentimes that puts a person to a calm state. Notice that I'm going to now go back to the hand, just thinking about holding a pen is causing me to go into the motion reading. Isn't that amazing? I'm actually acting as though I'm writing. I'm not even writing and I'm still doing it. Now I'll go back to the guitar. Maybe it's the fact that I'm not singing properly, or maybe my guitar is out of tune, or maybe we've been deceived to think that music is the ultimate way to get into the motion reading. I believe that if I go to the penmanship, I'm still holding on to my guitar, but notice that I'm writing and I'm automatically getting in to the motion reading, my theory called whole brain power has proven anecdotal evidence. Notice the quiet eye, that strong colored band here. That wasn't achieved at all when I was playing the guitar, even if I'm not even singing. Mm -hmm. 